Hey guys, so today I want to check out this new smart lock feature called Unbody Detection. So if we go to settings and scroll down there to about device, you see I have Android 5.0.1, which is required to have this nice feature installed. It's a default feature released by Google a couple of days ago, I think. So if we go to security and go to that smart lock menu, if you don't have it, you can go activate it in trusted agents here. Just go activate activate that one. And remember, you have to have Android 5.0 unless it won't work. So go to smart lock and remember you gotta have a fingerprint or a pin code to secure your smart lock. So in here you can add trusted devices, trusted places, and the new thing is unbody detection. So what unbody detection is basically about is whenever you have your phone in your hand, in your pocket, or in your bag, the phone will stay unlocked as long as it is on you, which is pretty cool. Like, why ever lock it as long as you have it, you know? The only issue I found about I find about it is it doesn't recognize you as you, but it recognizes you with its sensors. So if a thief takes it out of your bag and keeps it in his hand, in his hand or his pocket, it will stay unlocked, no matter who it is, just as long as it doesn't feel it's on a table or on a shelf or whatever you put your phone on. So that's a little bit of an issue, but otherwise it works pretty fine and the only way to lock it is basically leaving it like that. I would love to see it working better with trusted places. You know, trusted places is places where your phone stays unlocked as long as you are on that location. And that works very, very good. It works at home, at work, in school whenever you trust people around you. So if these two things could work with each other, you know, so the phone didn't lock itself whenever I left it at home, that would be cool. But until then, I will have to disable unbody detection because trusted places is simply more advanced and works way better than unbody detection. But otherwise, if you don't like trusted places or don't have trusted devices, unbody detection might be the thing for you. It's definitely cool enough and I enjoyed it for a little while, but honestly, trusted places is a little, a tad better, you know? So that was a quick little look at smart lock unbody detection. Hope you enjoyed, guys, and see you guys later.